A good win for our kids. I mean, no question about it. It feels good to be one and in CAA. Uh, did, did a lot of good things as a ball club. I think I'll rebound them in the first half. I haven't seen this uh, ended up tied, but did a good job on the boards tonight. That's a team that's averaging 16, I believe, offensive rebounds a game. So to, to hold our own on the board was really impressive. And, um, you know, we got, a, we got more balance this year than we've had in the, in the last year or so. Um, Rucker Stewart was good. Brandon Wood had a great second half. Uh, Tim Rustoven, I've said before, and I've said this many times about Timmy, I think if you know, last year was such an injury played year for him, if he can stay healthy, he's an all CA level type player, in my opinion. And, uh, but, you know, those three were good, but it, it, it was so much more. Uh, you know, Fred Heldring came in and gave us a, a great performance against his own. He's a great passer out of his own. Uh, and I thought Terry Tarp, the young freshman, was really good tonight. He was a real key in that second half spurt for us. Uh, defensively rebounding, uh, he'll score some big baskets too. I guess nine points, five rebounds. Love, I would really would love to. I had to sub Terry out about four minutes to play in the game. And, would love to have gotten him back, but it became a little bit of a foul stretch down the stretch, and and uh, we want to try to keep our better free throw shooters out there. Terry struggled a little bit in that area, but he just played a great ball game for us. Well, I thought we were better defensively. You know, we changed our defenses a little bit, as they did. I mean, that's nothing unusual, but we played some man, played a little bit of our matchup, did some different things that second half. Uh, so we're better defensively. Um, and as a result of that, we got some transition baskets, some easy baskets which seemed to get us off to the races a little bit. And I thought we did a significantly better job attacking the zone the second half. Um, excuse me. They play a good zone, but first half we just were stagnant. We held the ball stuck in our hands too much, and the second half we moved the side to side a little bit better. And we got it inside and made great things happen. We got that ball in the lane and either scored or kicked it out to wide open jump shooter. So, well, I'm not sure other than just trying to <coughs> emphasize it. You know, we had 11 turnovers at half and only four in the second half. And, um, you know, a lot of careless plays early in the ball game. We, you know, I, I, I've told our guards this, so I'm not, I'm not talking behind the back, but our guards have to play well for us to be good. In the first half, our two starting guards had zero assists and five turnovers. In the second half, I don't know, I haven't had a chance to study it really, but uh, you know, Marcus had four assists the second half. Now Brandon only had one, but we did a much better job there. Now, I mean, it's, we're one and only CAA. I mean, I respect their program immensely. Uh, it you know, it's, uh, feels good to win a CAA game. And, and uh, it just, uh, we haven't beat them in a while, as you say. I don't, I don't you guys probably know the record better than I do, but it just feels good to win. It really does. It feels good for this team to win a big game. Uh, you know, we played so well at Wake Forest and, and didn't win it. We played so well at Richmond and didn't win it. And I, I'm really impressed tonight because, you know, Wednesday night, we played a two overtime game on the road. You know, physically and emotionally, it took an enormous <coughs> amount out of our kids. And for us to come back and respond two days later this way, is a, is a sign of great toughness, to be honest with you. I don't know any other way to put it. I, I'm very proud of that. Well, we were active. You know, we were active. And, and I think, uh, you know, we, 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 one thing we chart in practice every day are deflections. And we, we were active. We got our hands on balls. I didn't realize we had six blocks. But, uh, uh, you know, Terry Tarpey, you know, is a very athletic kid. And, and uh, on the ball, he can block shots, but he also comes from behind a lot. Uh, and, Block shots isn't that important to me. Uh, I mean, for us, if you try to block too many, we're going to foul as well. So I would rather do a great job of making them make tough twos. But I do love how active we were with our hands tonight. Yeah. All right. Uh, it's a good win for us. You know, uh, this, is, this was a big game, seven because it was the next game. You know, uh, we lost. We won our first three, and we had lost our last three. So it's good to come out here and you know, take the home court, get a good win. Yeah, I mean, I think. Uh, they had that zone, and we realized early if we get middle, a lot of good things are going to happen. So a lot of good passes, guys inside, and also if they collapse on us, we other guys open threes. So we really executed that well and worked out well for us. Uh, Coach got us, you know, not to let the ball stick in our hands. You know, we were holding it too long instead of swinging it side to side. You know, getting the zone movement. So uh, 
after we, you know, we finally realized that and we got that down packed, uh, it made it a lot easier on us at the show. Yeah, I mean, that's that's huge. The CAA, first one in the CAA, I, think, I believe this is the first game in the CAA, so it's a good start for us. And also beating ODU, I mean, they're they're a great program. And like you said, like we haven't beat them. There's some seniors in there that's never beaten them. So it's good to, it's good for our program and we're excited about it all. That was great. That was great to see. Uh, we were actually just talking about that. You know, the fan support was amazing tonight. And uh, you know, we hope uh, they keep it up and we'll keep, keep the wins coming. That was great to see. Uh, I mean, honestly, it feels really good. I mean, those guys, Frank Cassell and the guys they had last year, they're Cooper, like they're good players and they have good players this year. And so I was glad to see. I think it's it's not that they got their program any worse. I feel like our, our program has gotten a lot better. And, and I spent a lot of time in the weight room. It was good to kind of be able to hold my own down there this year. Oh! <laughs>